you know what time it is. It's time to go outdoors with Nick. <laughs> anyway, back up here, uh, lost in the San Gabriel Mountains. Got a half an hour late start this morning, but that's fine. Need a little extra rest. It's about 7.30, maybe 8 o'clock right now. I haven't fully decided. My initial th thought was is uh, to move away from the hole I've been digging. I haven't decided though. I gotta go all the way up there and get my buckets. And then the spot I'm thinking about going to is back down river. So, I don't know, maybe, maybe I'll stick up there. Depends on what's going on up there, if there's anybody there. Uh, yeah, so, I'm gonna keep on going up there. I say that every trip. You guys already know, I'm gonna keep on going. Anyway, I'll see you guys in a bit. What a beautiful morning it is up here. Big old huge landslide right there. Rock slide, landslide, whatever. Anyway, sorry for my heavy breathing, but I sure have been hiking pretty quick. Anyway, just wanted to show you how pretty it is up here. It's gorgeous. This is the gold. Just being in nature. The metal's ju just a bonus. Anyway, I'm almost up to my spot. I decided to go ahead and stay up here. I'm gonna take this out right here. I should be able to shovel right into my sluice box, which would be nice. The sluice box is nice and set up. Uh, got the V's. Nice and centered. All right, I'm gonna put on my shoes and get to digging. Cause you know me, hiking in my sandals again. Anyway, I'll catch up with you in a little while. All right, so just moved that big old rock over there. That thing was huge. Had to have some help with that one. Been digging pretty much in this area right here. That's where that big rock came from. I'm digging underneath it. Figure I'd show you guys the sluice box. Getting a little gold. Anyway, run a little slow, but it's all right. I'm trying to capture the small. If you get the small, you get it all. That's gold cube, by the way. <laughs> anyway, uh, I'm gonna get back to it.
Did, did a couple test pens real quick and now I lost a piece of gold there it is so I got that in one pan it's not too bad I mean it's a nice flake would like to see more nice flakes but that just means I'm on the gold I'm excited for what's uh, to come later Anyway, I'm going to get back to digging and uh, I'll show you guys the sluice box here in a bit. I still haven't had lunch either. Looks to uh, be about noon right now. Anyway, I'm going to get back to it. So before I knocked it all down, so I'm digging. Let me back up and I'll give you a... Alright, so there's the sluice box. And I'm digging this cut right here. And before I knocked it all down, it was kind of a shelf like, like this right here. This is a shelf and it's a little overburden and I was digging it. I saw a piece of uh, visible gold sitting right about here before I knocked it all down. So, and my sluice box is looking really, really nice. Um, so I'm going to keep on digging and uh, yeah, this material is, uh, it's old. It's uh, real dark, um, like coffee, almost like a, a chocolate milk coffee color. Um, one of the irons that came out of here uh, is this honker. That's a chunk of magnetite. Anyway, all right, well, it's getting to be about three o'clock. There's the dig behind me, actually below me. Sluice box over there. Anyway, uh, I don't know if I'm off the gold or what's going on, but I've been chasing the dig back and forth, back and forth, and I don't know. Uh, the water's kind of murky, so it's kind of hard to take, so how, yeah, hard to see what's going on in there. Uh, so I'm gonna take this test pan, which is, I don't even know if it's on camera. Oh yeah, it's right over there. Anyway, uh, I'm gonna take that test pan and see what we get. but I took uh, three pans. The first two had nothing, and the uh, third pan uh, had like maybe six specks. So I'm just gonna keep digging. Uh, no sense in moving now, I only got a couple more hours, so I'm just gonna keep plowing away right here, and yeah, whatever. <laughs> all right, I've had about all I can uh, dig for the day, so, uh, Loose boxes down there. I'm gonna pull it out of the river, get to cleaning it up. So, all of that is what I did today. All through here, 
I'm terrible at pointing. So I'm about to be heading out, and now they can't see him. But these freaking horse flies, man, they're they're bad. They're evil. They don't leave you alone. It's been terrible. Anyway, uh, anybody that's coming up to the San Gabriels, be warned. These horse flies want you dead. <laughs> so we're walking through an area just kind of checking stuff out. And I walk up and bam, X marks the spot. I don't know. It does look good to my my eyes. I don't want to show too much because I don't want people coming up here and getting in my hole before I, it's a hole. <laughs> anyway, I don't know. Maybe X marks the spot. When you want to live, you find a way. This thing is just sitting on the ground and it's sprouting new sprouts. It's just drinking water through the tree. I don't know. That's pretty cool. How's it going everybody? So, ran into the man, the myth, the legend, Mr. Allen, <laughs> also known as Pharaoh on YouTube. Check him out. I'll put the plug in there and uh, you guys go check him out. Anything you got to say? Uh, next weekend, next yeah, next weekend, the 15th, we're going to have a cleanup. If you want to be part of a cleanup, uh, you can either come up Friday night and meet us at Cobra Campground or Saturday morning, we meet at the West Fork parking lot and we're going to clean up about a two mile stretch of the North Fork. I got a little bit of graffiti cover up left over and pick out some trash and then uh, go up to Colebrook and cook out and have drinks and food and whatever you want to bring. Potluck. Be there or be square. <laughs> hey, how's it going? So, it's the next day, it's Sunday. I bet you guys thought I was going to show you the gold, huh? <laughs> no, I, uh, I had totally forgotten to, to film any of that. Um, so, obviously, I'm back home. Uh, I do have my gold tally here. It was a uh, it was a nice take. Um, I have made a decision. I'm leaving that dig uh, for the simple fact that there's just too many travelers and hikers that go through there. It's just I'm looking for a little bit more peace. Uh, the gold is uh, has been pretty good, and uh, I've had a good time there. But it's time to move on. Uh, so without further ado, I'm going to show you my gold take from yesterday. Hey guys, that's what I uh, that's what I pulled out of the ground yesterday. It was a good day, very good day indeed. So, yeah, there it is. You guys got to see the gold. So, as you guys saw uh, towards the end of my video, I ran into Pharaoh. Uh, his name's Alan. Uh, he's uh, got a YouTube channel, and I'd have to say, out of everybody that I know. Uh, through the San Gabriels. He is the most knowledgeable and has been to more places through the San Gabriel range uh, than anyone that I know. So go ahead and head on over to uh, Pharaoh's channel. Um, I'll, I'll put up a link or I'll, I'll direct you guys there somehow. Uh, I'm not very good at doing stuff like that, but I'll figure it out. Anyway, um, thanks for coming along with uh, my channel, Outdoors with Nick. And uh, if you like what you see, uh, feel free to hit the subscribe button and the bell notification so you get an update when I upload, which is typically every Sunday or Monday. Um, leave a comment and, and share it. Thanks a lot. Until next time, happy pans, everyone.